Hi, my name is Ashish and in this video we will see threat trackers in Microsoft for Office which are available in Plan 2. So Microsoft 365 organizations that have Microsoft Defender for Office Plan 2 included in their subscription or purchased as an add-on have threat trackers. Threat trackers are queries that we can create and save in Threat Explorer also known as Explorer which you will see on the security.microsoft.com or Microsoft Defender portal. We use these queries to automatically or manually discover cyber security threats in our organizations. So let me just quickly log on to the portal and take it from there. All right, I'm logged on to the portal and uh, if you will see under uh, email and collaboration, you would have an option called threat tracker. I'm using the developer or the lab so that I don't have a plan to for uh, or you can say the licensing Microsoft Defender for Office plan to so you will not I'll not be able to show you but uh, permissions and licensing for threat takers is that uh, you should have a security administrator role group or you or you have the read only access to to Threat Explorer. The query is on the Threat Tracker page. Here, I'm sorry. Here. All right. And for Microsoft Entra permissions, you should have a global administrator or security administrator role. And to have the read only access to Threat Explorer queries on the Threat Tracker page. Your membership should be in the security reader or global reader roles. So the threat tracker page contains uh, primarily three tabs, saved queries, tracked queries and trending campaigns. So the saved queries contains all queries that you saved in Threat Explorer. Tracked queries contains the results of queries that you saved in Thread Explorer where you selected track query and in tracked campaigns Microsoft will populate the information on this tab to highlight new threats received in the organizations. So when you will see details under saved queries you can sort the entries by clicking on an available column header you will have the date, name, type, author, last executed and you would see under tracked query you would see if you want to need to run that query manually and if the query will automatically run periodically okay and in the tracked queries you would also see the date name uh, what are the today's messages count prior day message count and the trend today versus the prior week and in the trending campaigns tab you would see the information on the uh, trending campaigns tab you can sort the entries by clicking on available column header you would see the malware family prior day message count trend and uh, the targeting is it your company or is it targeting globally okay so this is what I wanted to tell you about threat tracker tab under email and collaborations on Microsoft Security Defender portal. I hope this was informative for all of you. If you have any further questions, please mention them in the comment section and I will see you guys in the next video. Thank you. Have a good day.